today I want to talk about social media of all things. Um, I think social media gets a lot of bad rap in popular society. People talk about all the bad things, all the bullying that happens with social media and all those sorts of things. But I think because we sometimes we're a society that looks at the negatives, a lot of times we miss a lot of the positive things that happen with social media and the beauty of it. Um, and I'm specifically talking about Twitter. Um, I think Twitter's a very interesting medium. Yeah, there's a lot of bad things that happen on Twitter. There's people talk about things they shouldn't be talking about online. There's lots of bullying, that sort of thing. But I think when you talk only about the negative things, you miss out on a lot of the positive things that the internet has brought us, that Twitter has brought us, that Facebook and Instagram have brought us. Um, so I'm going to tell you three stories, um, I think three, about these positive things I've had um, because of Twitter and you know, what it's brought into, you know, my life. Okay, so to begin with, um, let's see, this happened a few months ago because it was still warm outside. Um, and so our, I talked about this in a video, our president um, of our university, he's really cool. He um, loves being involved with the kids and that sort of thing, and so he loves Twitter. So a few months ago, it was really, really, really hot in my apartment. And, you know, it was like 90 degrees outside, and we don't have air, air conditioning in our apartments. Um, and so I tweeted out at our president, and I was like, hey, it's really hot. The, you know, the bed, we here in Elmwood can really benefit from some popsicles. Uh, I think maybe half an hour went by, and I get another tweet back that said, I'm on my way, find the Suburban. And um, he came in, he gave us popsicles, and um, gave us a ride in his really cool Suburban, which he loves. Um, and that was all because of Twitter. Because with Twitter, I was able to connect with someone who maybe not necessarily wasn't on the same social level as me, but I was able to communicate with them that we were in need of something, you know what I mean? Another cool thing that happened um, was I was on Twitter, um, and I just made this list of my favorite, some of my coolest people I'd ever want to talk to. I included my one of my favorite YouTubers. Her name is Melinda Kathleen Reese. She's really cool. She does the um, Google Translate Sings videos. She's really, she's only like two years older than me, but she's really smart and funny and talented, and I really appreciate her. So I said I would just love to have a conversation with her or with um, J.K. Rowling because she, I just find her story amazing. Um, and Julie Andrews, because I love Julie Andrews, I've always loved Julie Andrews, and um, Shonda Rhimes, who writes Grey's Anatomy, because I think Grey's Anatomy is like one of the greatest shows ever written. Um, and so I tweeted out at this tweet that I'd love to have a conversation with these people kind of thing, um, that like the people I look up to, and um, Melinda Kathleen Reese, who I said was my favorite YouTuber, actually responded to the tweet and said, you know, I'm flattered of that list, <laughs> I'm flattered to be on it, you know what I mean? Um, and so it was really cool because I was able to have an interaction with someone who I admire, who I love, who I think is like, you know, the bee's knees. Um, and they were able to respond with me because of the amazing thing called the internet. And because of Twitter. Um, because Twitter, I think, it's a weird, in the, in the realm of social media, it's interesting because you can, I think, branch that social media, that social societal gap. Um, because I can tweet at somebody you know, who's really famous, and they might respond, you know what I mean? Um, you know, like that. Or I could, you know, there's like, not that thing anymore. And another story that happened also involves the Spaldings. Um, with these really cool candy bars, um, which you're gonna hear about later, um, that we have on our campus called Shine Forth Bars. Cause that's like our slogan, Shine Forth. Um, and so, I would mentioned that I never had one. My best friend had one a few weeks ago and I wanted, I would always wanted to try one. So I tweeted out, I've never had a Shine Forth bar. I'm, sometimes I just sit alone in my apartment and I cry because I've never had a Shine Forth bar or something like that. And I just left it. I left it be. Um, I think my first lady, Sharon, does follow me on Twitter. So I think she might have seen it. But one another boy who, who follows me, he retweeted it at her and said, Hey, you should get this. This girl deserves a bar. You should hook her up. And so within, I don't know, half an hour, I got a tweet back that said, okay, it'll be in the mail sometime this week. So I had a Shine Forth bar, which you'll hear more about later, like I said. Um, so I think, I just, I just don't, I don't know. I feel like this social media has so much bad rap, especially like Twitter and Facebook. Like, it's all about people. Now, I know a lot of people who sh should keep things off of Facebook or off of Twitter or you know what I mean. But I think 
we look so much at the positives that we don't see the neg the, the, that we see a lot of the negatives, like the popsicle story, which was one of the coolest nights of my life because I felt so awesome, or the shine forth bar, or you know getting to talk to one of my favorite YouTubers, like saw my tweet, like that's cool, like I can tweet at somebody famous and they could respond. I could show somebody my work. I could tell someone my ideas and it can be shared all over the world. Like, yeah, that's scary, but I think that's also really cool. Like, we live in this society that the internet is everything. Social media is everything. We're surrounded by media like we never have been before. But as we've seen in history, media has this ability to control the world, you know? We invented the printing press. That's media. At the time, that was their social media. And it, you know, changed the world. We were able to print books. People became more educated. That sort of thing. And I think if we take the thing we have, like Twitter, you know, and we use it for good, we can change the world, you know what I mean? And I think I love Twitter because of that. Like, you have, well, you used to have 140 characters when I was a kid, but now we have 280 characters to change the world, you know what I mean? And we can take things and that we couldn't do before, and we can share ideas with people who aren't like us, because we can at them, or we can DM people, and we can talk to people, I mean, I DM'd my president a few weeks ago, not my, not the United States president, but my university president. I DM'd him on Twitter and I asked him a question about something. That's beside the point. But you have this ability to connect with people on this whole different playing field that we never have been able to before. And I think it just drives me crazy because people always only look at the negatives and not at the positives. So I'm going to segue out of this by saying you should go follow me on Twitter. And you can hear all about my fun life and everything. Um, my handle is at Hoagland underscore Jahane. I'll put it. At Hoagland underscore Jahane. Um, also, I really, really want to do uh, an Ask Jahane video. I'm a human a thing. But I've wanted to do one for years. But I've never had any Qs. So I've never been able to give any As. So, if you have a question you want me to ask answer in a video... So I can have some good content on this channel, because we all know it's pretty lousy. Please tweet it, or Facebook it, to hashtag AskJahane. That's hashtag AskJahane. So maybe I can do a Q&A video. Maybe an extravaganza, maybe later. I don't know. But I'd like to do one, because that would be cool. So, hashtag AskJahane. And you can add me in that, too, if you want to. So... As always, have a blessed day. See you later, potatoes. Oh, that's just awful. Bye!